So by now, most of you should know, my name is Yusuf Scott, and I want to welcome you to the Southern Easy Forex University. All right, so by now, most of you should know that my name is Yusuf Scott. I'm the guy behind the Southern Easy Forge University, also better known as the Forest Gold Line. In fact, go visit www.theforestgold.com. All right? Now, listen, as I tell you guys in all of my videos, you know, from day one, I'm very appreciative, very grateful, thankful of you guys who follow me. You guys have follow me from day one. You guys come and watch my YouTube videos. Very thankful for that. Listen, if you're not yet subscribed to this channel, you're watching this video, be sure to hit that subscribe button at the bottom. Make sure you also follow us on social media because we're over there on Facebook and Instagram as well. All right? Now listen, um, I know that a lot of you have seen the video that I put out a couple weeks ago. It's a trailer that I put out telling you guys about the GDP and ZD. Okay? You guys should already know that that is my favorite pair. Okay? I have done some damage in a good way. With that pair over the years, um, my, my biggest run with that pair was uh, back in 2015, ran that uh, market from September 2015 all the way down, fully absorbing everything that happened during the Brexit. While a lot of people had gotten taken out of the market, I was riding the market and I caught that wave going down and then some, all right? So, if you guys look at where the market is today, that level is sort of connected with what's going on right now. And I put out the trailer telling everybody, listen, 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 expect that market to go up. Now, one thing about me, you guys already know I'm a long-term trader. I look at the market from a long-term perspective. So, while some people may be saying to themselves, well, you know what, why does this guy say this market is going up? And then over the next couple days, it starts going down. You know, and then now you see the market took off and went up, all right? Then that's because of how I look at the market. What it is that I'm seeing in the market is telling me that market is going up, all right? See, one, one thing for certain is a lot of people, they get caught up on the smaller moves because people, they trade in a moment instead of looking at the bigger picture. They get faked out mentally and physically by the move that may happen tomorrow, the move that may happen at 11, 13 a.m. PST. They get faked out by those things. Whereas me, I'm looking at the big picture because the big picture is all that matters. That's what they're looking at, all right? They're looking at the big picture, so I'm following their coattails, all right? So, um, that being said, if you got in on the GDP and ZD and you believe in the move, if you believe in that move, you will realize profit right now, serious profit. The thing about me, I'm not trading the GDP and ZD. Uh, the GDP and ZD is, crazy with swap going north, all right? One thing that I realized over time is that, like I'm trading on the GDP, JPY, I'm riding that one up on two accounts, but I'm not trading on the GDP, NZD. That's my strategy. I know that the GDP, JPY is gonna give me positive swap going up, and I know that that market is going up, so what am I gonna do? I'm gonna ride that market up, and I'm gonna, I gave out the trailer alert on the GBP and ZD about that one going up, but I'm not crazy like that to ride the GBP and ZD. I respect the GBP and ZD, and I'm gonna let that one, you know, for those of you who wanna trade that one, I'm gonna let that one go up on its own. I'm just gonna watch it, observe, and say, you know what? I told you it was going up. I knew it was, all right? So listen, I, just, I hope that, for those of you who are watching, hopefully you guys are able to get in on the GBP and ZD. It's a fantastic setup, fantastic move. Let me tell you this. If you're not already in on the move, don't waste your time getting in on the move, okay? What you should do is take a step back and learn from the move. Realize why the market went up. Realize what you could have done to have gotten in on the market before now because you don't want to get in on the market right now. Trust me when I tell you, do not do that. Could you make money? Of course you can make money, but not the most, okay? So uh, I just want to let you guys know this. Hopefully this video made sense to you guys. Hopefully by now, with so many people talking, saying this guy, he's this and that online. Listen, listen, you guys know, I can
to make calls like this each and every day like I give my students on Mondays at 5 p.m. Standard Time during our regular training. You know, I can make calls like this publicly all the time, but I, I don't do that because I realize that, you know, at the end of the day, people really don't respect free stuff. All right, so in order for you to get the whole kit and caboodle, you have to become a student, okay? And, but every once in a while, I will give you great opportunities like this where, listen, you could have made a lot of money on the GDP and ZD over the last couple days and just took your money, bagged it, and got out of the market over just the last couple days, all right? But, you know, the bottom line is, you know, every once in a while, I'm going to give out these free trade alerts because, listen, just because I'm not trading don't mean that someone out there, those of you from all across the world, you couldn't trade all right, very simple, very easy. Listen, as I always say, you guys, um, you know, have that to show you a fantastic day. Stay healthy, stay safe, and stay creative. Peace.